What is up guys and welcome to another Red Dead Online video. As of right now, the Moonshiner role is now live. Everyone can get on their Xbox, PlayStation 4, PC, whatever it is, and you can play through this Moonshiner role. So far, I have done a couple videos on it already. If you'd like to see them, I'll leave links in the description down below. The first one is an introduction to Maggie Fike and the role that you play as when going through this Moonshiner role, as well as I have also gone through every single unlock that you can get through the Outlaw pass in this video we are going through all the different unlocks that you can get through going through this moonshiner roll so to find them what you need to do is go into your menu you go down to progress and there you will find roles in roles you have the trader collector and also the bounty hunter but obviously right at the beginning now you now have the moonshiner roll as you can see i'm only rank one i have only just started but you can see all the different stuff that you can unlock and that is what we're going through today so the top row is stuff that you can unlock by progressing through the rank whereas the stuff down below requires rank as well as you need to buy it and also use unlock tokens so through rank you can unlock unlock tokens which allows you to unlock the stuff down below you then have a berry cobbler moonshine you then able to get more unlock tokens you then have a bootlegger opportunities which is a free roam event normally you can unlock these at rank 4 and it's the exact same as the other roles so I'll probably imagine that the rest of this stuff is in a similar sort of situation and then you can unlock the bold dance by also getting in unlock tokens you can unlock a toxic moonshine pamphlet you're able to get the home gloves which look very nice you're able to get the levens gun belt you're able to unlock a new type of horse which is the norfolk roadster which in these colors you can get the speckled gray and the black coats now you can unlock and buy this at the stable as soon as you unlock it with your unlock tokens but i would wait off with this type of horse wait until you get to rank 20 to unlock it later you can then get a bar expansion which is then something that will happen at your shack you then get another type of saddle and then you also get a different type of clothing which is actually looking very nice and this is for those that want to look and get involved with that moonshiner role at rank six you're able to get the wild creek moonshine at rank seven you can get an ingredient satchel upgrade at rank eight you're able to get more unlock tokens at rank nine you're able to get a new buyer order and then at rank 10 you get more unlock tokens as you can tell there are a lot of different unlock tokens but as you get down here you're able to unlock the darrow buckle which looking very nice you're able to get flammable moonshine which i think is going to be very nice once you get into those missions you're then able to get a different variant of the sword off shotgun you're then able to get the nevin hems flick flask which attaches to your belt you'll also get a band expansion which then is something that is played within your shack so this is something that a lot of people have been talking about it's very expensive 850 dollars uh, but i'm sure it will be worth it you can get a condenser upgrade which is crazy considering that is cheaper than a band upgrade you then are able to get a new type of outfit at rank 11 you're able to unlock a new cheerful dance you can then get spiced island moonshine more unlock tokens for rank 13 and also rank 14 and then at rank 15 you get a master distiller which reduces the time taken to create a batch of moonshine as for the unlocks you're able to unlock a monocle another type of color of the same horse so this is the exact same horse as the previous ones but you're able to get different types of coats and also the stats are slightly better you're then able to unlock a new type of outfit and then you can get a new type of hairstyle after that you're able to get a polished copper upgrade which yet again is very very expensive 870 dollars but this is definitely worth it and then you can get the levens holster and then finally the last ranks whilst being distinguished as a moonshiner you're able to get more unlock tokens you get a material satchel upgrade you get even more unlock tokens and then you get protection which greatly reduces the risk of attacks now this is something that i'm also interested about with the trader you had the exact same thing but to this day i still haven't been attacked at my camp so whether or not this is actually important we'll soon find out and then finally at rank 20 you're able to unlock a dance a new emo and then as the unlocks you're able to get yourself a very nice outfit and as always with the last page of anything whether it be the outlaw pass the wheeler rawson and co club whether it be other roles that we've already had or future roles in the future the last page always offers the best stuff so that is looking like a very nice outfit you're able to get a new emote which is called hangover the horse it is the exact same horse type as what we've had before but this will be a very high statted horse as well as it's just very nice coats as well so the coach change as well as it's going to have very high stats better stats than the previous horses we've already had but this is also very expensive 950 dollars and then finally you're able to get yourself a hat so that is all the unlocks that you can unlock whilst going through this moonshiner roll where it is 
just by ranking up one by one or you can unlock them every five levels using unlock tokens anyway guys how are you guys feeling about this new role are you enjoying it are you not enjoying it leave it in the comments down below but anyway guys i hope you guys did enjoy if you did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and subscribe but for now i'm going so see ya